Hi and welcome to this new version of Program 25 with Plot, which I've modified to make it function within Multicharts version 8. I had a couple of uh, requests from customers to do this and uh, what I had to do is remove some of the syntax, um, the method and the token list that I'd used in Program 25 with Plots. So this program functions pretty much the same uh, in fact, exactly the same apart from I've added a few extra inputs to enable you to change the background and foreground colors for bullish and bearish patterns in radar screen or market screener. And the program works by looking for candlestick patterns. It also has a couple of filters based on stochastic and percent %R. And uh, you'll see here that we've got the, the chart and radar screen linked and uh, this is trade station version 9 and uh, if we were to click on a particular stock this particular case we'll then see a chart come up and you should see a uh, the patterns that have been indicated in radar screen appearing on the chart and you'll notice also that what I've done is built in a little gap so if there is a pat two patterns for example on one bar they'll be separated by a little bit of distance so you could see both I think one of the, the, the features of the radar screen part of the program is that it's not just looking at the last bar. There is a user input which determines how many bars back you look, starting at zero. So, for example, um, in this case of MON, it's showing us two patterns and the setting is five. So if we count back uh, actually six bars, starting with um, the first bar here, so one, two, three, four, five, six you'll see that you'll see that uh, within those certain bars one two three four five six are appearing here we've got the bearish engulfing and we've got the uh, the morning star and the morning day star appearing here on this particular line so just to show you those new inputs or rather let me just click on the radar screen and the new inputs for the color backgrounds so if we double click on the program and we go to the inputs, you'll see that the color the color inputs are down here. So for example, we could say, okay, we want to change that to cyan, maybe instead of red with like a magenta and uh, perhaps white would be a little easier to see in terms of the text, the foreground color and uh, say, okay, okay. And then in a few seconds, you'll see that the radar screen will begin to refresh with the new colors. So you may also be interested to go back and look at the original Program 25, which uh, gives a little bit more detail about some of the uh, the way that this program works and, uh, and what it does. Uh, also, incidentally, on the chart, we have the, the words here. You can turn that, uh, change that. So if we click on the chart, you can make it show me dots instead of the, the text. And we do that using an input called plot or not so at the moment it's set to false if we set that to true then you'll see we get the show me dots rather than the text and uh, also in either radar screen or on the chart you can determine exactly which of the candlestick patterns you see by changing this uh, number here from 1 to 0 or 0 to 1 so 1 if you want to see that particular pattern 0 if you do not and uh, I mentioned the filters you'll see the uh, stochastic filter uh, you can set that true or false and you can put in high and low and also percent R filter true or false and you can put in the percent high percent low to determine uh, whether that filter will filter out based on stochastic or percent R respectively anyway hopefully you might find this program useful